Rachel, firstly, congratulations on winning SWPL Player of the Month for January. How does it feel to pick up the award? Thank you, yeah, it feels good. Um, I think you get credited for something, but the, the bigger picture is that we've had a good month um, as a club. So, yeah, credit to the girls as well for this. Yeah, and four wins for the team across January, across three different competitions as well. Must be so positive to still be competing on three fronts. Yeah, I think the main thing is we're still unbeaten. Um, that's in all tournaments and the league, obviously. So, yeah, it's brilliant. It's what you want to be doing, isn't it? Staying consistent. So I think we've done that off the back of the Christmas break and we've got better and better as the month has gone on. Yeah, and how good was it to start the new year so positively after such an impressive first half of the campaign? Yeah, I think it's difficult to stay at that level, you know, when you we've been top of the league now and uh, we've got people, ch you know, clubs chasing us. But yeah, staying consistent is the main thing and that's what we're doing week in, week out. And four goals for yourself across the month. How happy are you with your own form at present? And how settled do you feel into the squad now, of course, after being here for a wee while now? Yeah, I think that's the main thing for me getting settled, getting consistent minutes. I had a little bit of a strange start to the season, in and out of the squad and things, but yeah, the group has allowed me to be who I can be and be the best version of myself. And we push each other to be that and to bring ourselves out on the pitch the best that we can be. So yeah, credit to them too. Yeah, and just looking at some of the games individually across January, the Celtic win must stand out for you in particular, such a big boost for the squad and booking your place in that Sky Sports Cup final. Yeah, first game I played against Celtic, apart from right at the start of the season. So, uh, yeah, I was excited for it. And yeah, it was definitely uh, an entertaining game, wasn't it? So, yeah, right until the very end, until Rio slotted that penalty in. So happy to get the result, and that's the main thing. Yeah, in the Aberdeen match, the last one of the month, you, of course, were the, the difference maker with two goals in that day. What's your reflections on that one? Yeah, I think for me, it's just really nice that I can contribute. Um, finally, that's how I feel. Um, I feel like I've been going to the motions and I think since Christmas I've, I've, I've played my part and you know there's been injuries and, and I, I haven't been within the squad for periods of time but when it was needed I contributed and I, you know that, that's what you want to do. And just looking ahead to the weekend's game now of course you'll take on Partick Thistle how much you're looking forward to carrying on momentum from two ones already this week. Yeah looking forward to it obviously it's difficult playing in a three game week it's hard on the body and you have to use the whole squad and you can't train as much and things like that but we've definitely got the characters within the group to to push out another good performance I think and it's interesting then going into another game where we have to play them um, obviously in the final. Yeah and part of course they're a team in form now as well it looks to set to be a, a fascinating contest how ready we have to be of what they can bring to the game as well. Yeah of course I think it's gonna it's gonna be a game of sizing each other up I think um, obviously the most important thing for us is we stay consistent in the league um, but definitely then looking at obviously the game coming up as well. Yeah and it was a closely fought encounter when the two sides last met I know you didn't play but how much do you feel like the team's come on since then? Yeah I think I think you can see in our performances that every week we're learning more we're bonding more as a group and the togetherness is there between all of us and it can only get better I think I do truly believe that this the best still isn't hasn't been. Yeah, and just lastly, of course, it's the last game of this three game week. How challenging has it been for you as players? But how much will it mean to get another positive result after the two wins already? Yeah, I think it, it's, it's very tough mentally, physically playing in the three, uh, three game week, especially when the timings of the games don't go in your favour. But um, yeah, sticking stick to the plan, sticking to the tactics, you know, trust in the process, and I think getting results is the main thing on Sunday.